my appearance, but your girl has been cleaning this morning, like deep cleaning and organizing because I have not had time to do this and I've wanted to for so long. But I just wanted to show y'all what I have set up for myself in the hallway. Um, due to organization, I've come up with me a little workspace in the hallway and I'm so excited to show y'all. So, hold so on I have this piece, it's like the secretary. Okay. And for so long, I had not utilized it. And I got in here and I cleaned out all these drawers, organized it, have it, you know, set up. And as I was cleaning this, I told James, I said, I'm going to start using this. So I fit us a couple of picture frames, put one of my little iPads here, and I'm going to start utilizing this for what it's for. So in doing that, I did put a little basket in here, put me some pens. I have a notebook, uh, extra checkbook, and I'm going to, you know, gradually put me some like office supplies, whatever I feel that I would need and use um i'll be putting it in this drawer and i think this will be a fun little place for me to sit and do some edits because right across from it i have this chair so i can literally just slide this chair up to it work here and then put the chair back so i'm very excited to use this i think it's going to be perfect i need some input from y'all um I did do a, um, I filmed a video this morning that I'm, I don't know if y'all would be interested in seeing or not, but it was, um, an organizing cleaning video for my guest room because it was just a hot mess, hodgepodge, hodgepodge of just stuff everywhere, just kind of threw in there because nobody uses that room. So it's just easy to kind of like throw stuff in there. So I got in there this morning and started cleaning and I filmed it. Um, I haven't put it together yet. It might not even be anything that I can use, but my question is, is that something y'all would like to see? Y'all like those kinds of videos? Um, I don't know. I personally like watching cleaning videos. They really motivate me and um, I like them. I don't know if y'all will. So if you would, just let me know in the comment section um, if that's something you're interested in and I can definitely um, do that. Um, not a problem with that. Um, like I said, I haven't even put that video together yet, so I don't even know if it'll be something that <laughs> I can piece together and make it make sense. But that's not the only time I'm ever gonna be cleaning, so <laughs> that's a mute point. But anyway, just putting that out there. Y'all just let me know if that's something um, you're interested in. I got up this morning with the intentions of deep cleaning and organizing and, you know, washing baseboards and all that kind of stuff. Stuff I've wanted to do, have neglected, not really neglected to do, I just never had, never had really had the time. Um, so, with that being said, it has taken me literally all day to do the guest room, this hallway, and the front bathroom. Now I'm fixing to move on to the kitchen. Oh, but I have some storage issues in there that I know I can eliminate and create more storage. And um, so I think that's gonna be next because all I really have to do in my living room is just dust and sweep and mop. So I'm moving on to the kitchen. The laundry room's done. And I am trying to get that video uploaded as we speak. It is, for whatever reason, I've tried three times. I've had to cancel all three uploads because it would get to a point and just not upload anymore. So when I was started over, it wouldn't upload at all. So I don't know, I'm gonna have to figure that out. Hopefully I can get that worked out. But anyway, um, so yeah, I was just gonna run that by y'all. So if that's something y'all are interested in, if it is, just let me know in the comment section about the cleaning videos. So on to the kitchen. <sighs> Y'all please forgive my appearance. I seem to be saying that a lot in these videos, but I am so tired. Um, I did not vlog at all Saturday, today's Sunday. Um, we went up to my mom's, to the rental property and we work all day long. Like 
there's not a place on my body that does not hurt. But I'd do anything for my daddy and my mama. So we had we made a lot of progress. Um, of course, now we're James is getting some more gas. We have to make another stop at Lowe's. And um, we're gonna have another full day of it. Oh. I actually fell asleep with my contacts in my eyes last night. I slept with my contacts in, which I never do. So I took them out this morning. I wore my glasses today because I hope I don't get an eye infection. Because anytime I've ever fell asleep in my contacts, I end up getting an eye infection. Fingers crossed that doesn't happen, but it's another scorcher today. I have my helper. He's got his eye on daddy waiting for him to come out of that store. Buddy, Buster, you gonna say hey to everybody? I called him Buddy because I, <laughs> I did that yesterday too. Uh, I had another Chihuahua named Buddy. <laughs> it looked nothing alike. I don't know where that come from, but Bub, hey, look here. Anyway, I just want to touch base with y'all. Um, I will show y'all what we're working on when I get up there. So, uh, yeah. It's going to take us a, probably a full week to finish, complete everything. But when it's completed, it will be done and it will be done right. So she can rent it out and it'll be a nice place for someone. So. Anyway, that's where I'm at. I hope y'all have a great Sunday, and I will touch base with y'all in a little bit. All right, James is tying everything up from Lowe's. Granny has already called my phone twice. <laughs> Had my ringer off, I didn't hear it. And she texts me, <laughs> said, y'all be here for dinner. I'm like, okay, we must. So she's got a big Sunday lunch cooked, and we're fixing to go eat. Which is good because I'm starving. Um, Y'all, I died last night when I went to sleep. So I had not slept the night before. And um, I literally died. I think I got in bed at like seven. I don't remember anything else after I got in bed till this morning. I woke up and it was like almost nine. And um, up there. <laughs> um, it was almost nine and I got up because I knew we were going to leave around 10. So I got up and made me a cup of coffee and just sit there for a few minutes, folded a load of laundry, straightened up the kitchen and um, then I went and got him up. Bless his heart, y'all. I just love this man. I love the way that he loves my family. And anything we can do to help my daddy, who's not a spring chicken anymore, take things off of him, I'll do it. I'll do it. And that man feels the same way. Like my daddy walked in yesterday and um, he asked James, he was like, what you want me to do? James said, sit down. <laughs> Y'all, he just loves my daddy so much. And because my daddy wasn't was really tired yesterday and had a rough night the night before and just he's just not a spring chicken anymore none of us are but anything that we can do to take it off of him I'm gonna do it and um, so we let him piddle around and, and do some stuff and help and we just got in there and did and that man back there right there start crying if I think about it how much he loves my family and, and takes care of them and that just if I didn't love him that would make me love him you know what I'm saying so anyway we are headed to granny's to eat and Buster's just got the vents blowing on him chilling in his little bed and uh yeah See you when we get there. Okay. Now we're going to work, Papa. There's Miss Toby Jean, named after me. Toby. Why is she named after Donna? 
don't get me. Oh, she gets it hard, eh? What? She gets it hard in the dog. Popo! That's the truth. Her hard it. Hey, Toby! That's the way she got it. Oh, she's going to say, Dollar Jeans, Toby Jeans, she knows. That's it. That's the last straw. So my mama don't want me to catch her on film. No. So I'm thinking, hmm. Hmm. How much would you pay me not to film you? So this is the property. Down the hall. This is one of the rooms. Wait. Realized when we pulled up some carpet, we had some damage, so we're replacing all that. Replace the walls here, and then the closet doors will go back up, and then it'll all get a fresh coat of paint. <coughs> we're replacing all the floors. This is the main bathroom, as you can tell. We've pulled out the tub. We're going to be walling all this up, taking part of this wall down because we've got a new tub. We're going to swap the ends um, with the shower. The shower will actually be on this end so he can, if he ever needed to come in and replace any plumbing or whatever, it would be through that bedroom closet. <clears throat> and James is going to build a new vanity, place a light. And then this is a doorway that goes into this, this bedroom course we have replaced walls pieces that has needed it and replace the floors and then this is another bathroom which we're going to replace and fix <sighs> yeah and then we're gonna I'll get all new flooring and this is where the washer dryer goes So, there you go. This is the living room, which the walls are good. We're just going to paint, place the flooring, and then we're going to replace the flooring in the kitchen. We've got to replace this wall. It had, this wall had two mirrors on it. We tried to remove the mirrors because they looked horrible, but we weren't able to get the mirrors off, so we ended up just taking the paneling out. And gonna paint all the cabinets. James did go in here yesterday and build on his shelving in there. So we will be painting all the cabinets and all that. And when it's all done, I'll have to show you that because you're not gonna be able to believe it because gonna look amazing but yeah I mean we're replacing flooring so stuff like this doesn't happen this happened from previous renters and uh, yeah we've got some new flooring that we're gonna put down because um, to prevent stuff like that I mean and bear in mind when I do the reveal that this is a rental property so you know, you have to bear all that in mind when you're fixing things up. Um, things that you would normally do if you were living in it might be different than what you do for renters. And I have to remind myself of that. There are things that if I was going to be living in it, you know, I would definitely do differently. But we're trying to keep costs down and make it efficient, uh, make it right, make it look good but also um, so my mom and them can have, you know, some extra income. Uh, it's kind of like a little retirement plan for them. So yeah, that's where I'm at and that's what I'll be doing today. And it is hot as Hades in here. Um, we left the air on and I guess it froze up. We're realizing that we have an issue with the air conditioning. So we're gonna be working on that too or have somebody come out and do that. But yeah, for the most part, here we are, and I'm already tired. It is hot, but I was gonna show y'all something. Hold on. Buster has figured it out. He has made him a bed. 
with the fan blowing on him. How much more spoiled can you be? If we didn't have fun, it would be work, right? You must really love your mother and father-in-law. Yeah. A lot. <laughs> and your wife. Yeah. Thank you, baby, for all your hard work. What's Papa got? What's Papa got? Hallelujah, fans.